wrist pain. Great dancing. How do you get it? What's up? Hey guys, what's going on? This is Donovan Smolich at Check Yourself. And have you ever experienced wrist pain when you first started breakdancing in the first couple of months? Well, I did because when I first started the first year, I still had wrist pain and for the second year, it got even worse. So today, I'm going to be talking about how do you manage wrist pain and today, I'm going to show you how to prevent it and how to manage it. So, the nerves are usually compressed in the carpal tunnel between the bones, most commonly, or in your muscles between pronotaries or even your shoulder and all these nerves are coming from your neck and that's why it's good to get managed by a chiropractor especially when you're breakdancing, you're jumping on your wrist and on your spine. So the first exercise I'm going to show you is dynamic movement. So before you break dance, we're going to do this with our wrists because we got to get motion because movement is life and you got to get fluid in those joints. If it's too stuck, it's going to cause some pain like symptoms. So we're doing this, you go all the way around. Now we're going to go do some dynamic static like stretches. So we're going to go to the floor. And you do this right before you start break dancing. You need some more flexibility in your wrist and you can build this over time. So I'm gonna lean forward on my wrists and I'm gonna go back and forth. And you're gonna feel a huge stretch. If you already injured yourself, it's gonna be a little bit painful, but it's good to do these kind of stretches. And you wanna do it sideways like this. So you wanna go every angle to open up that tunnel in your hand to get that interference off the nerve and to get some blood flow in there. So this one's backwards. I'm gonna be leaning back like so. Mm -mm -mm. This feels amazing. <laughs> so now we're gonna do the opposite. You're gonna go on top of your wrist like this. You're gonna lean a little bit backwards. This is gonna change your life. Now we're gonna go to the side and lean back and forth, trying to just open up those bones to get some fluid, blood flow, get rid of the nerve interference, get better nerve conduction back to the spine, back to the brain. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we stretched out our wrists and a couple more stretches, very simple. We wanna do this, like this. And then one great, fantastic one is you wanna traction your wrist like so. So you're going to go on the tunnel right here, you're going to put your hand over here, and you're going to pull it down like this. And you're going to try to get some motion in there. And you do it on the other side, get some motion. You do it to the other side. This one's amazing. You could traction your wrist to get some motion back in that tunnel. Well, you feel amazing right now. You want to hear comments? <laughs> No. Okay, so now we're gonna do um, some mus some self myofascial release with your muscle. And um, what you can do is you put your thumb right here on your forearm because you want to press out everything. Like it could be coming from your tunnel. We already mobilized the bones there. Now you can press out the muscle. So you can put your thumb here, and you're gonna actively move the muscle, and you're just gonna go down the whole forearm. And this is not specific, but it's going to help us promote blood flow, nerve conduction, you name it. Get all the toxin and waste stuck in your arms. Yep, and you just go down the whole thing. And this is going to help heal it way better. So you do it with both sides. And now, so if you want to start doing this so you're gonna start breakdancing more often. You're gonna do stacks and footwork. So you wanna start doing this stuff so you can help your body recover faster and not get your bones degenerated and arthritic <laughs> So we're gonna be able to do this. Uh, uh, uh. So this is Check Yourself with Donovan. We're gonna have this every Tuesday at 9.30 a.m. And if you have any comments for any other breakdance-like injuries, leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. I'm out.